Greetings everybody, this is Dan again, and it is 8 in the morning, Wednesday, October 12th, and I'm about to go into work, but later today, we're going to go see this wonderful movie. Uh, I was going to be doing a vlog about it all day, see what uh, folks think of that, It'd be me and my wife, and kind of cataloging our, our journey today, but I am at work. And it is going to be time for me to actually go do something for multiple hours. So, uh, we'll see you guys here in a little bit. And I'll magically be done with work for the day. So, see you guys in a minute. Victor, where's Mommy and Daddy going? Um, we are, we're going, Mom, my mom and my dad are going to see the new Godzilla movie! Are you going? Why? Because he's a tool. Shush! Um, as I was saying, I don't want to go. It's because it's probably going to be loud. It probably will be loud. Yeah, it probably will be loud. And, and of course, and I hate the that's okay. It's I been like, what? You hate what? I hate when the cards over. Because they're loud. loud, yeah, they are loud. He didn't loud. like the other one, did he? No. Nope. Did, did he go see the other one? You wouldn't seen the other one with us, right? Yeah, when I worked but in the theater? I didn't like him. Oh, okay. He held his ears most of the time. He's a tool, man. He does he's completely strayed from the path. He used to like it, now he wants nothing to do with it. Like every kid, they don't want anything to do with anything their parents do. It's like twenty years after the fact. But anyway, Victor, of course, that's Vic back there. Uh, it's been like four or five years since he's been in a video and everybody's been asking about him. And then there's Mr. Ridley. Ridley, say hi. Hi, Ridley. He's a <laughs> But he's in the, I'm going to scream at everything stage. But Nate, And our new one. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Ridley's, Ridley's named after oh. two of my very favoriteest things. And I'll put, we'll put little, little, the little images up. Ridley. Yep. And then oh, over here is, is, is Sarah's banana. I don't know if you can see her. That's, that's our newest addition. Sarah's our newest addition she is, um, chewing Kaiju on her feet. Yes. And the newest addition to Kaiju Movie Reviews. That she'll be chewing on everything. But she's right? after, named after two of my wife's favorite things, which are not chocolate and pizza. <laughs> or chocolate and Mexican. <laughs> so I settle down. No, because I can't name her uh, taco or queso. Or... Yeah. Well, you could name her queso. I mean, well, why not? Everybody else is naming her. I mean, but if people could say, well, they have that right. I didn't want it to be too weird. You well, know, they have that right. It's just different. But anyway, because we accept all kinds. And when you're the in this this part of uh, the country, it's different. Huh? Yeah, exactly. Different here? Is that, is that really? I don't think I've it, heard people say it. Oh, my God. <laughs> Tennessee, ladies and gentlemen. Um, East Tennessee. East Tennessee. And Goji's still with us. See, there's Goji. He's along for the ride. Yeah, yes, um, he fell in the floor. Where'd the tickets go? In my lap. Okay, she has the tickets. Wife has the tickets. She's helping record. So you'll see like video quality because she's a way better camera than I do. But we're going to go drop the kids off and then we'll get some more shots later of us doing things. Things. It went dark. I can see you. It's dark now. As soon as I hit record, it went dark. Oh. <gasps> Where were you on the night of January? <laughs> well, we just finished the movie. Uh, actually, I was going to try to get video of us walking up to the theater, sitting down, kind of assessing and talking about it a little bit. Well, I actually had the wrong theater. I was thinking of the one on the opposite end of town, and it was, technically, but I didn't even know this specific theater even existed. It was, in, it was so <laughs> buried. It was in the dumbest location ever. Uh, not the cinema's fault that I didn't find it. it was my fault for not researching it enough properly. But, and that's with two T's, that was an interesting movie. Very. What say you, wife? What's your opinion on that? It was definitely different. We're not going to spoil anything for those of you who have not seen the movie. Uh, I will say the theater was had more people than I thought. It was over two thirds full. It was probably let me guess seat count it, probably like 150. It probably would seat about 150 people, give or take, based on my experience. Uh, it, it was. It felt like Evangelion. 
like in, in like some of the shots at the beginning, I'm like, this is even yelling. And it had its moments, and I'm not going to do a full review. I just kind of want to lay the, you know, set the stage for you here. Um, I'm trying to hurry up. We're, we're trying to hurry up and get back to the kids because the baby's very upset and not she cooperative. Wants her mama. Yep, she wants the mom. Um, movie did not play out how I thought at all. I actually liked how it was. I, I don't. I don't want to say how much I liked the movie, in absolute fairness, because I, I need to think about it. There, there's there's a lot more going on than your usual Godzilla movie. Um, Goji looked good on the big screen. Very good. Uh, they did something that I think they should never have strayed away from a long time ago was a focus on him as a natural disaster and I like how they handled that and I like him being a socio-political it being socio-political commentary um, and it, it was awesome I like that part it was actually uh, I don't know how much I want to say without spoiling it <laughs> I just don't. I mean, I want people to see it. I mean, this is, it's Wednesday. I'm hoping to have this video up tomorrow. Uh, and by the way, in the comments, tell my wife happy birthday because it is her birthday today. And she is the greatest wife in the world for allowing this to happen on her birthday. And she says she wants to go, but I really don't think she cared all that much to begin with. <laughs> but I did take her out to eat beforehand. And she got orange chicken. From Panda Express. Now I want dessert. And now she wants dessert, but we're trying to hurry up and get home. But anyway, it's not Godzilla. We got to focus on it. What, what did you think, Mom? I thought it was good. Different. <laughs> Some weird uh, camera things going on, so, which was a little odd, but you know. If you've seen Evangelion, you know what you're in for. Yeah. Um, Godzilla has googly eyes. Googly eyes! And yes, I did take Godzilla into the theater, and I'm wondering how many people said anything, because during the end credits, I kind of held him up over my head and, like, walked him on the screen a little bit. <laughs> he I was, was like, dancing. We were down in the front, because when we got we got there late. We got there before the movie started, thankfully. I would have, gosh, I would have freaked out. Um, Close enough, because you like watching trailers. Well, no, I, the only one that I saw was good, that I was really interested in was Kong, and then yes. the, and then the Great Wall, which is funny as hell. <laughs> Whiten it up, Matt Damon in China. Anyway, we like, won't talk what? about that. Yeah, people are laughing at the audience. Go watch the trailer. It was the same Kong trailer we've already seen. Um, well, most people have seen it from Comic Con. Oh shoot! I like how I like how the movie ended. Like, the ending, like, their conclusion of what happened to Godzilla at the end of the film. But, like, the ending ending was... It was it was Evangelion weird. It was Hideaki Anno weird. And, and if you've ever seen it, you kind of have an idea what's going on. Uh, but, but I won't, again, not spoil it. Don't look it up. Just... I'm putting this video up tomorrow. It's going to the 18th. Find it. Watch it. You need to do yourself that favor and go see the movie. Uh, it, it's it's good. I approve of it. And I want to say it's it's like amazing, but I want to think about it a little longer. Not to say, because before I just go out there and say that, and everybody's like, oh, like, Dan, you're full of crap. It wasn't amazing. The movie's done really well in Japan, as I mentioned in my the last few reviews we did. Uh, me and Zach did. And uh, it just... I don't know. It, it's doing well in Japan. I can see why. I can really see why. Um, but, but I don't know if I want to say anything else about it at this point. Do you have anything else you'd like to add, Molly? Maybe. What? Why are you cackling? My spoiler alert. No. Not, <laughs> it will, I will cut that out of the video. I will, people need to watch the movie. I know you can look up spoilers. No. Just watch the movie. <laughs> If I looked up the spoilers, actually, the ending of the movie was actually spoiled to me on Facebook. Um, so sad. It was in a, a, a post in a group I was a part of, and 
they said that this was before the mass don't put spoilers on here in the group and uh, somebody said something I'm like well that sounds kind of stupid and when you watch it, it it's neat how they did it it made sense but that's just me so I'm assuming you have nothing else to add then aside from your spoilers that you want to say but you're not gonna okay well supposedly Zach's gonna go see it uh my brother lives about a thousand miles away. I really hope he goes and sees it because we, we need to talk about this on a video, but, you know, hopefully. That's all I'm going to say. But hopefully you enjoyed this little vlog we did, and we are going to go rescue our children, try to get ice cream, and I need to go make my wife a cake. Because... And it's 10 o'clock at night. It is 10.01, and I'm driving from Knoxville to our house. That's how it's, I don't work tomorrow. My wife does. I really hope she doesn't work in the morning. Oh, I'm pretty sure I do. Uh, anyway, we're ending this. We'll see you guys in the next video. Spoiler alert. Snape kills Dumbledore. <laughs>